The son of an Arlington man murdered on a test drive to sell a car says his father had moved the family from Iraq to the United States for a safer life. Now tonight, two men are in jail for last month's murder of that 55 year old father. And now that police have suspects in custody, the victim's family feels more comfortable about discussing what happened. Fox Sports Peyton Yeager is in Arlington with more on the murder investigation. Peyton. Heather, Arlington police say GPS tracking confirms the two teenage suspects were together at the time of the murder. Meanwhile, the victim's family, they've been in Iraq since the day of the murder. They are there to bury the 55-year-old and also to make sense of this loss. Homicide detectives utilized cell phone records and surveillance video when tracking down the two people they say killed an Arlington father of six while he was attempting to sell a car last month. 18-year-old Luis Gutierrez and 19-year-old Christian Saucedo now face capital murder charges after Arlington police say the two men shot and killed 55-year-old Kudair Hamden on March 21st. Hamden's son tells Fox 4 he was the one trying to sell his purple charger on Facebook Marketplace, but he wasn't able to meet up with the potential buyers, so his father offered to do the test drive instead from his home. During the drive, police say Hamden was shot inside the car and then left on Port Richmond Way. Investigators located the purple charger abandoned at a shopping center off Matlock Road. Later, we were able to retrieve their faces from the surveillance camera. Surveillance video shows the suspects being picked up in a black charger. According to an arrest affidavit, cell phone records obtained by investigators placed the suspects where Hamden was fatally shot and also where the purple charger was ditched. Once they retrieved the cell phone number between the messages between the suspects and the victims, they were able to trace it to a location in Dallas. On April 5th, investigators spotted the black charger the two were last seen in outside the Dallas home, which turned out to be stolen. Dallas police conducted a traffic stop where people inside the car began to throw guns out the window. Luis Gutierrez was arrested. Gutierrez was already wanted as a suspect for a 2019 robbery in Dallas. Police say Christian Saucedo was able to run from officers, but those close to Saucedo later identified him to police using this still frame of the 19-year-old in a black ski mask. U.S. Marshals arrested Saucedo Friday at his Dallas home. It helped a little bit, but it's still not... Nothing is going to help because we lost our dad. The two arrests bring a bit of closure to Hamden's family who have been in Iraq since Hamden's murder. Hamden's son spoke to us by phone on Tuesday. The reason why we came to the U.S. is to be safe. My dad brought us there to be safe. Now we got my dad killed there too. Like, I don't know where, like, where we should live. If you are attempting to sell anything or purchase anything, please do it at one of our four uh, police stations um, where it's safe. Gutierrez sits in the Dallas County Jail facing multiple charges, including evading arrest and unauthorized use of a vehicle, as well as the capital murder charge. Saucedo sits in the Tarrant County Jail, also facing capital murder.